at a local, regional, national, and international level. So what do you so what do I see us striving in the ACT chapter over the next coming period? Um, well, I'll divide these into sort of five main categories. Encouraging broad and meaningful participation in citizen science. Facilitating inclusive and collaborative partnerships. So, supporting the establishment of a community-based practice, um, knowledge and tools. Ensuring the value and the impact of citizen science and its outputs are realised. And supporting the, um, the national organisation as an effective trusted and well-recognised organisation. Let me elaborate a little bit on, on each of these. Encouraging participation in citizen science. We plan to hold a number of seminars, perhaps not as grand as this, um, throughout the year, where we'll showcase citizen science activities that are happening both in the region, but also um, external to the region. We'll share what we learn from the region, so the, show, the uh, case studies from the region, with other areas around the country and potentially overseas. Next category is facilitating inclusion and collaborative partnerships. We'll seek to establish relationships with um, other ACT and region-based groups. Um, we're also planning to build up our regional membership numbers. So expect people to come knocking and say, if you want to join. Um, and the next category, uh, support best practice, knowledge and tools. We will establish a government agency, all levels, um, community of practice, initially within the region, but with the intent of expanding it beyond. The community will facilitate the exchange of ideas, learnings, methodologies, and approaches across all levels of government to allow citizen science and its data to be better integrated into the broader, into broader initiatives. Next, next one is ensure that the value and impact of citizen science is realised. It's not much worth, it's not, it's a little disheartening to get, do all the work and then realise that nothing's happening with it. Um, we will strive to ensure that through demonstration, through demonstrating the value of citizen science, um, including aggregation and the opportunity for collaboration, to address, that we can use this to address goals within the region, nationally and globally, for example, the UN Sustainable Development Goals. Participating in uh, citizen science engagement at a national, international level, um, especially around data and Earth observations. So there, there are people, I'm not sure whether they're in the audience this evening, um, that participate in, in those types of um, functions. And we will be supporting the national organisation in establishing and maintaining and commuting, communicating both to them and from them as to what's going on in citizen science. Lastly, the ACT is not an island, and I see the CS as ensuring that the chapter establishes and maintains a regional base. This region is rather unique within Australia, having all three levels of government represented, as well as linkages with the research world through the universities. I would hope to see the ACT region, region chapter, ACT and region chapter, take a role in raising awareness of citizen science and ensuring the effective use of the knowledge gained from, it, uh, from the local through to the international level. Again, thank you all for coming. Uh, uh, following a short sort of few notes from our national people, um, there'll be food and beverages served.